Hello everyone, I'm Christina from Japan Unbox, and today we are going to be unboxing Umi Twins. This is the March box and it came a couple weeks early, which is great. It shipped out the next day. Um, this is going to be the Totoro theme. This is what the box looks like on the outside. As you can see, it's really pretty purple. Umi Twins. And now we are going to take a look inside. Here's the inside and the box. It's really pretty. Here's the pamphlet. We'll be taking a look at this last. The first item I see is this little plush cat. It's really soft, lightweight. The bottom's made of beans, little beanies. I'm not too sure why this is in a Totoro themed box, but it's really cute, so I can't complain. Nails Stuff Ink. Super cute. The next thing I see is... It looks like a 3D jigsaw puzzle. I am really excited for that. We are going to open it up real quick. And these are the little pieces. Here's a close up of the little pieces. They're pretty transparent. Here is the finished product. They just stack right on top of each other. The next thing I see are these little squares of paper. These are the prints that you get. I think that one's my favorite. I was super excited for the towel. They uh, gave us a little preview on Umi Twins Facebook page and this is the one I got. I'm super excited. I wanted one of the strawberry ones and it's really thick. It's made of pretty thick material. I love the green and the blue background. And that's what it looks like. And the scalped edges. The next, and it looks like the last item, is the Totoro Origami. Umi Twins also released this um, as a little teaser as to what was going to be in the box. I'm excited, but at the same time, I'm not that great at origami, so this is going to be really interesting. I think I'm most excited for the cat bus, even though it looks like the most difficult. And that is the end. This is the inside of the box. Nice packaging. There wasn't too many items in here, but overall, I liked it. Here is the inside of this Totoro. I love the graphics. March lineup. Oh, it looks like they have an origami tutorial. That's great. Here's all the possible things you could have gotten. It looks like I got the cat. I'm kind of... I wish that I had gotten one of the owls. I really like owls. It says, Shinada Fukurara Plush. This month, popular Japanese plush maker Shinada makes an appearance in your box in the form of, you guessed it, a plush. 
These cute animals from the Fukurara series are said to bring you good luck. They are said to be ensuring your good fortune by meditating with their eyes closed. Whether or not they actually bring good luck, they will certainly bring you comfort with these cute facial expressions and softness. Okay, so that little guy is what we got. This is a jigsaw puzzle in the papers. It looks like everyone got the same thing. The origami everyone got. And these are the hand towels that everyone got. I think besides this one, I would have really liked to see these two. Here's the origami box tutorial. And the photo contest. So every month they try to do a photo contest. And this looks like the grand prize. So I will definitely be entering into that. It looks like you can get a knee blanket, a plastic water bottle, and a three month subscription. And then five runners up will receive a Totoro stand clip and a free Umi box. So thank you Umi Twins for doing this. This is great. Here is this month's Umi prize. If you are a subscriber to Umi Twins, you are automatically entered into the grand prize and this is what they are featuring it looks mostly like hello kitty which i'm super excited and rila kuma this tells you a little bit about the ghibli museum unfortunately while we were in japan we never got to visit but it says that it's located a short train ride away from the central tokyo in mitaka this visually stunning museum is dedicated to the arts and techniques of animation and includes elements of technology, fine arts, and children's museums. You can see the replicas of both the famous cat bus from My Neighborhood Totoro and the robot from Castle in the Sky. There is even a restaurant that serves warm and cold food that will remind you of good old Japanese home cooking. And that is really cool. Here's the back. If I had to rate this box uh, from a 1 to 10, I think I would rate it a 7. I really like the Totoro items, but I was kind of hoping for a little bit more, like more items and a Totoro plush. I think we all were hoping for a Totoro plush, but the, the plushes that they did include in this box were pretty cute, so I can't complain too much about that. Um, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, comment below what your favorite item was that you're most excited for, and that's it. Bye guys!